finally, it's time to show who is king. Another Canadian rematch takes place in the ring. Regardless of what happens, this ends tonight. The crown is in sight, but I'm insanely nervous for this fight. I've waited all season for this day. All that stands between me and victory is Matt O'Shea. Okay! We made it. After a hell of a season, it's only fitting that one and two go on once again. They ha there were two people who came for my throne as King of Canada, and both of them wanted a rematch. Took down Amel. Now we have to take down Matt as well. If you guys are excited for today's Pokemon, why if I battle, hit the like button and subscribe button down below. Matt brought, he didn't bring Frostlass, which is a huge deter, or a huge like change that I didn't think would happen. He did bring Jirachi, he brought Terrakion this time. Other than that, the other five I got right. He did bring Incineroar this time. If I didn't see Frostlass, I lead Seismitoad as it matches up well against everything. If he leaves with Jirachi, that's kind of annoying if he tricks turn one. Let's go for it, let's lock it in. Good luck fun to Matt. If you guys have not already checked out Matt, make sure you guys go do. He is an am amazing player, amazing dude. And hell, this is back-to-back -back finals for Matt. He's out for blood. I'm out to, to finish an almost perfect season. So regardless, this is hopefully gonna be a great game. So I am insanely nervous in case you could not tell. Escanor, is that Incineroar? Blazing that Hellcat Incineroar. You definitely have been to him, right? So I am relaxed Seismitoad. Which kind of blows if he sped crept me, but I, which I think he will. But I think he might hard switch here. Uh, free rocks is free. Free rocks is free. I get a toxic on Slowbro. I don't really care about getting knocked off. Free rocks is free. He does knock off. That's fine. One fifteen to Seismitoad. Uh, Incineroar. I am gonna be calking a shit ton this game, so prepare yourselves. Uh, 115 is 45% with knockoff. That is a max roll on max attack Adamant Incineroar. Yeah, 115. That is a max roll on max attack Adamant Incineroar. He cannot kill me. Earth power is extremely free here. He doesn't have a switch in. If he goes into Landorus, I like Toxicking here because I think he might parting shot into something like Slowbro or Landorus. I'm going to Toxic here. I think Matt's going to try and make the aggressive on me. He knows he doesn't kill me here. He's going to knock again. I'm already overplaying. I'm already overplaying. That play doesn't make any sense. That play makes zero sense. Oh, I shouldn't doubt myself. I shouldn't doubt myself. I knew that wasn't... Ugh, whatever. Rocks are up. This thing's toxic. He's on a timer. I bring in Scar afterwards. Scar or Scar allows me to start breaking through things. We're okay. We are okay. We are okay. This is a roll to kill me. He does get the kill. Okay. All right. Um, whatever. I shouldn't have overplayed. I knew attacking Cinder was my first turn. I didn't need rocks, but... Uh, okay. Shake it off. Shake it off. Shake it off. Don't get tilted. Okay. Scar Obstruct forces a kill. Marshadow also forces a kill, but also forces a free slow bro as I have to click close combat. Obstagoon, he doesn't really have a switch. And he makes an aggressive Terrakion. I'm gonna go Scar. I don't think he makes the Earthquake play if I make the aggressive um, Scar here. I don't think he makes the Terrakion play. Um, I have to obstruct here so he doesn't knock off my flame orb. I do need to get it activated. Oh, he switches again. Elric into Jirachi. Why? What is your plan here? What is your plan here? I want to obstruct to know what you're doing. Why? Why hard Jirachi? If you're going to make a hard, why not into Trakion? Expecting close combat, I guess, as a mid ground. He does have Aura Sphere. I didn't think he could fit it. He's also special Rachi. Didn't think he would fit that. Okay. Um, finding out he's not choice is going to be good for me. If I go to Oogie, he goes where? Incineroar back in. I can bring in Scar as I take a hit very easily. If he U-turns on my switch out here. He does get up rocks. I'm playing into him. I'm playing into him. Fuck. He's not leftovers. I'm glad I didn't miss that. Okay. I just shadow ball here for free. If he goes into Incineroar, it's getting chipped by Toxic and, and fucking 
Shadow Ball. I have Obstagoon that pivots in. He does have U-turn. So he's not Healing Wish. He's not any of that. He should just go Incineroar here. Marsh Shadow still looks insanely free, ex including the fact that Jirachi's last move is definitely Psychic. It might be Kasib. Which means he's probably Helmet Bro for Melmetal. Did it not say on the screen? Was that just me? Did I miss that? Kasib slow, bro. Matt, I showed you last time this thing learned Shadow Ball. Why did you forget? Why did you forget? That's fine. I just fire it off again. I can very easily take a hit and then regen out um, to still check Terrakion with these. And if you want to teleport hard into Landorus, that's fine. You play right into me. Which is actually the momentum shift I would really need. He's going to let me Shadow Ball him again. I don't have speed investment, so he's either teleporting or it's a speed tie. But he's kept hella low. Teleport? Spit after up. Teleport? Teleport. Show me Landers. If you show me Landers, I will gladly take this Glow King trade. I will gladly take this trade if you go Landers here. You should go Incineroar, but you might try to make an aggressive into Landers. Escanor the Incineroar. That's fine. He's not Boots. He's not Boots. That's insane. Okay. Bring in Scar. I don't mind getting knocked off. It is annoying, but it's better than anyone else getting knocked off right now. I don't want to bring in Melmetal. It doesn't do anything. Rocks. Knock off. That's fine. That hurts, but it's fine. I kill this Incineroar, he brings in Jirachi again, or Terrakion. Still have Gloking at full with the Shookaberry to check Terrakion if I need to. Um, I just click Facade, claim my kill. He should just sack this off, he doesn't switch into rocks anymore. If you make Jirachi play, you're a genuine sociopath. Like, wholeheartedly insane person that needs to see a mental hospital. Custap. What was the reasoning there? What, what is that for? Why are you flare blitz instead of flamethrower? Okay. 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 Incineroar doubles down. That's actually okay with me. That's okay with me. Oogie. Beats everything that comes in barring Zekrom if it's... And even if it's Zekrom, that's A, very early. Does Baymax do the same thing? I can high horse for that Jirachi. I can get a Toxic on Slowbro. I don't beat Slowbro if it comes in. I just get a Toxic off on it, which isn't great. Oogie beats everything that comes in. The only thing that does not beat Oogie is if he is Lumberry Zekrom, which I have. Thunderous in the back for it. Forces my endgame a little bit early. Guy, the Terrakion. I live any hit unless you are adamant banded. I live any hit here unless you are adamant. Oh, I'm not at full. No, I should be fine. I'm Shooka. I'm Shooka. I live Banded Stone Edge unless you're adamant. I click Psychic here. Earthquake. Drakion's dead. Okay. Take the Shooka. Eat that up. Drakion's gone. Blow him back. Blow him away. No pay Appa. He should die every time here. Boom, boom, yes. That's the shift we needed. That's the shift. Yes. Yes. There we go. There's the shift. Landorus comes in and revenges. I can let Gloking go. Can I let Gloking go? Kind of need it for Jirachi. No, I have Marshadow. Mm, could be Kasib. Armstrong, the Landorus. Yo, if I out Matt O'Shea here by clicking Ice Beam, I think I win the game. What's worst case here? He earth powers, I bring in... Marshadow doesn't kill guaranteed after rocks, right? I ran this calc a thousand times and I do not remember. No, I don't guaranteed kill after rocks with Marshadow. So I just bring in Melmetal and force him out. I still have Thunderous to check the Zekrom and Slowbro. Marshadow can clean this up. I'm gonna try and out Matt O'Shea, Matt O'Shea. He should just earth power here, but he might rock polish on a switch out. Come on, Matt. I know you want to rock polish. 
You want to be faster than Marshadow. You got to be faster than Marshadow. You live one from full. The earth powers, it's fine. I just bring in Melmetal. I scream Shookaberry like the top of my lungs. He does earth power. That's fine. Goes down. Melmetal comes in. I scream Shookaberry at the top of my lungs. Like I'm screaming bloody murder. But Marshadow doesn't kill and I die to Psychic, so I have to make this play. This is such, such an obvious Shookaberry. He's got to know that. I really want to make the double here. Make the double into slow bro and force a kill here. Because this screams shook a berry. Like it's not even funny. Why would I bring this in? If Matt thinks at all, go into slow bro. Elric. Oh fuck, that's not good. Why? Why did she go this one and not slow, bro? Spectral Thief. Unless he's conceived. Psychic doesn't kill me. Psychic does not kill me. Psychic does not kill me here. He's double lure. He's double lure. I still does so much. Guaranteed little psychic here. He's Thunder Wave, but he missed. Why are you walled by Marshadow? What? What is this set? Why are you walled by Marshadow? Why? Why did you bring a set that was walled by Marshadow? What was your plan? What? I'm sorry, Matt. That blows 110%. But just kill me, bro. Why? This is in this went from Okay, this went from losable to insanely winnable. Not boots. Does Marshadow sneak? Or does Marshadow... What's his name? Um, close combat. He can go a fairly bulky Zekrom. 58. That's 42%. Oh, I don't think I do 42% with Thunderous. I don't come anywhere close. If he kills off Marshadow here... I don't think I can take a Bolt Strike into a thing. I think I have to make the hard Baymax play here. Yeah. I make the Baymax play here. I don't let Marshadow die just yet. If he sets up, worst case scenario, I sack Thunderous, take the, take the boost with Marshadow. Bolt Strike. Yep. Because he couldn't set up. Because he knew he died to one into one. Ow. 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 You're banded. Nope. You just crit. Uh, um, uh, uh, there's a roll to it, Kale. That's not good. That's not good at all. That's not good at all. Fuck. Okay. Okay. This is, there is a way out. There is a way out. There is a way out. If he just takes his kill here. He does take it. Okay, there is a way out. It's not a good way. By any means, is it a good way? By any means, is it a good way? But it is a way. Genie has to come in. He takes 12 from rocks. What's... 42 minus 12 is 30. If I get a high roll sludge bomb, he's in range of CC. If I get a high roll sludge bomb, he's in range of CC. If I get a high roll sludge bomb, he's in range of CC. 
Oh, if I was Wave. If I was Wave. I feel like we're just short. I feel like I'm just short. I think we did it. I think we- I think that's it. He's Lum. He's Lum. He's Lum. He was Lum. Okay. No, 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 motherfucker. No, motherfucker. No, 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 no. Not on my watch. Not on my watch, dude. Nah, -uh, not you. Nah, -uh. no, 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 no. No, no, stop that. You stop that right fucking now, Matt. You stop whatever bullshit you're doing right now. You stop whatever bullshit you're trying to pull on me right now. Stop it. Stop that. You stop that right now, young man. You stop that right now, young man. You stop that right goddamn now. You stop that right goddamn now. This shit is mine, bro. That shit is mine. This shit is mine. Nah. -uh. Nah, this is mine, dude. What are you at? What are you at? 54? Oh, you're gone, a spectral thief. You're gone. You're gone, dude. This is it. This is mine. This is mine, dude. This is mine. This should never live. This should never live. This should never live. Okay. Here comes the scare. If he's Scarf Lando, he has it. If he's Scarf Lando, he has it. And there is absolutely nothing I can do about that. He's Scarf He's Scarf Lando. There's nothing I can do about it. He's not scarfed! Put the world upside down and made it rain upwards, baby! Woo! Don't you disrespect me, little man. Don't you derogate or deride. You're in my world now, not your world. And I got friends on the other side. He's got friends on the other side. Yes! One more! lucky but we take that shit anyways baby Woo! let's go oh my god that feels fucking amazing yes ggs to matt like i said i'm not gonna sit here and say that i outskilled matt and i outplayed him at every turn no i i got lucky that thunder wave miss co cost him the game i'll give him that Matt 100% got fucked out of that win. I feel bad for him, but I, there's only so much I can control. GG's to Matt. Make sure you guys go check him out. He had a phenomenal run, an amazing player, an amazing content creator. I feel bad. I am sorry. But with that, I am not only the BBL Season 8 champ. I am the first two-time Wi-Fi champion twice on Gen 8. I cannot be held back in this league, dude. I cannot be held back. Oh my god. Um, I put so much work into this. I gotta shout out everyone. Even though I don't get a whole lot of build help, I did get a little bit of help this week from everyone. So, shouts to my boys, Kaz, Ant, Owen, Jay, everyone, all the goons that I know are watching right now. Shouts to you guys. And, uh, CGT, you're next. Oh my god, let's fucking go. So if you guys did enjoy today's Wi-Fi battle, please hit the like button and subscribe button down below. On the left-hand side will be YouTube video recommended for you, and on the right-hand side will be the rest of our BBL Championship playlist, if you have not checked it out already. So with that, I'm going to get on out of here. Thank you all for watching. My name is Kurt, and I'll see you guys next time. And thank you for all the support this season. My name has been Kurt, and I'll see you guys next time. Peace. I am out.